One moment, she says, and 15 school children are proving she may be right. For most Israelis and Palestinians, as well as for many students, it is almost impossible now to imagine a future free from violent conflict. The pupils of Tobias School say they don't talk politics much, and some say their future is likely to remain dominated by constant strife between the two divided populations. But the same children have begun working with each other, crossing the divide that has affected the land they live in. Tobias started the Jerusalem Circus a year ago. A non-profit organisation, the circus teaches children circus skills with the ultimate aim of performing in Israel and the West Bank. The circus school soon proved popular with the Israeli and Arab communities in and around Jerusalem. The children are from as diverse backgrounds as their trainers, one of whom is a Russian immigrant and former circus performer and the other a Palestinian actor. The Israeli children come from immigrant and conservative backgrounds as well as left-wing homes and the Arab children come from Israeli, Arab and Palestinian communities in and around Jerusalem. The circus children intend starting circus performances in the next few months and are busy perfecting a mix of coordinated and individual acts. Despite the violence, there is still hope to perform street circus acts in front of Israelis and in the West Bank. The growth in the use of gyms and fitness centres is a worldwide craze. The Sports Industry 2001 exhibition is an example of all that is new in fitness gear and health products. Gyms are an increasingly popular leisure pursuit around the world. The Fitness First chain started eight years ago and is now gyms throughout Europe and Asia and turned in a profit of 12.8 million pounds sterling last year. In a bid to make people fitter and healthier, some governments are considering bringing in a scheme to encourage doctors to refer patients for exercise. Some of the apparatus seen in today's gyms look relaxing, some more like torture equipment but there is every sign that the appeal of modern gyms will continue to grow.